I draw goo goo creepy crawlers his eyes so bare uh, in a uh, I'm going on a spur of the moment long overdue hike I'm going to take you with me sorry for the poor footage but I'm filming all this on my cell phone because it is a spur of the moment thing um, over there just above the trees is a cave I can't tell if it's coming out on this or not because of the sun reflection. And uh, when I was a little kid, my friends and I would come up here, and there was there was nothing up here. It was just mountains. Uh, now we've got. Let's see, that's uh, I think that's the cemetery over there. Over here we have housing. But all of this used to be just open mountains, and it was awesome. And my friends and I would, you know. Uh, pack up our backpacks with uh, peanut butter and jelly sandwiches and grape sodas and uh, sometimes brought our BB guns. It was it was exactly like uh, Stand By Me, except uh, we weren't looking for a dead body, but we had, it was like, anyway. So we would come up here and just explore everything back here. See, I've been doing this a long time, or it's been, yeah, and uh, have a great day. It was so awesome. I'm so glad I'm not part of uh, that. I was born before all the electronic age really kicked in, as far as you know, like video games and well, cell phones. Uh, we got out. We got dirty. We got scratched up, and it was great. We had so much fun. Okay, so let's see if I can get over there. I'm really out of shape because I haven't been taking care of myself lately. I haven't been exercising, smoking too many cigarettes, and. Uh, this is going to hurt, but it'll be good. All right, here we go. One thing, like I said, this is spur of the moment. I just had to get out of my house. There's been a lot going on personally. And uh, I had to get out. And I've got uh, this much water that I just bought earlier today. I should have brought more, but if I went, went if I would have went back to my house to get more water, I would have stayed there and not done this. So just go make going at it as I do it. All right. Now it looks like there may be a trail or two going straight down into these this thicket, but I don't know if it goes through the thicket. And I really don't want to run into rattlesnakes. It's been kind of warm. So I'm taking the long way. It's good for me anyway. Uh, like I said, this used to be just all, you know, open fields and kind of uh, mountains. And, uh, you know, it was really awesome. You know, the kids that don't do it today, they, they you don't know what you're missing. Get your kids out of the house. Take away their electronics. Force them to go get out and get dirty and scratched up. It's good for them. Our parents uh, knew where we were going, generally, the general area. And I'm, I'm telling you, we were out five, six hours at a time, blistering sun during the summer, and it was awesome. It was just great. Okay, let's continue. Well, here's one cave. A little bit, kind of a cave. Yeah, we didn't have all this stupid gang tagging and stuff. I mean, the yin yang thing, yeah, that was normal. Uh, if there was any graffiti, it usually said like, Glad Zeppelin, or uh, say hi, or I don't know. And here's a creek bed. I'm filming the best I can because everything's there's a reflection I can't see anything uh, creek bed so I'm gonna have to remember that and the next time we get some rain I'm gonna come up here and see if this thing's flowing down uh, I remember when we did come up and it had been raining we'd come up when it was muddy too which was a lot of fun uh, it was cool because we would find the uh, streams and things like that and you know we come in these caves and hang out and have our, our peanut butter and jelly sandwiches and grape sodas and 
what was that? Anyway, uh, once in a while, you know, you found someone's stash of Playboys or something. So that was pretty cool. Um, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, they were always like mangled and weather, weather, uh, de degrading from the elements and everything like that. But still, hey, you're a kid. It's boobs. And yeah, okay. Back in the day, there actually used to be, you'd find old cars that got dumped up here, probably stolen. And, uh... Who knows, could have been Manson family related. And uh, just, there, there used to be an actual mansion or something. I remember because there was a swimming pool. It was gross. And they also had a, uh, there was a gun range. And there was the, the base structure of a house. Um, that's all gone now. Okay, well, here we go. Below, uh, yeah, yeah, check this out. Hang on, let me get a better thing over here. Did you hear that bird? That was cool. Sounds like his batteries are running low. All right. I think this is the one. I'm not sure. Wait, over there. Stop fucking. Actually, that's not bad advice for some people. Death. S. Near. This is supposed to be the metal band death, and someone added. And they. Oh, it does say is. I thought there was an S. But anyway. Blue nipple. Oh, how did I miss this? We got a pentagram here. Ooh. I. I. Here. I don't know. I can't get it. Man, I don't know what that is. Apparently, if you don't hike for a while, it makes you gassy when you do. Now, the cave I'm looking for is bigger than this. I'm sure it was. But I think it's on the other side here. Uh, I just have to figure out how to get to it. Deep here. I love that bird. <laughs> okay, I've realized why I'm not helping and puffing. It's because I'm going downhill. It's uphill to get you. And, uh, yeah, good one. And I think I found an old car, like I was talking about before, so that's really cool. Two old cards. Excellent. Um, let's see. What the hell is that noise? Here's some weird noise. 
don't know, someone messing with me, but I think it's some kind of strange farting bug. All right. And this is a Volkswagen. So, the reason this is kind of interesting is uh, trying to get a good shot of it. Maybe from here. It is because uh, Spawn Ranch, you know, that's where the Manson family was for a long time before they got arrested. Anyway, they would steal uh, Volkswagens, dump the bodies to keep the frames, and then convert them into dune buggies by putting like Porsche engines in them. And this could be one of them also. And this is not a uh, Volkswagen. It's quite a large car. But before all the things were built around here, it was common. You would find this stuff when you went hiking. I'm really glad I came out here. I swear, there's these little bugs. I'm not making it up. When I fart, I'll tell you. You come by and they go, pfft, pfft. No, I can't. I can't. I can't do it. But it's weird. Okay. I'm going to try to get some, uh, see if I can get a picture of this from the back. This is the front rim. Look how far long, look how deep it's buried. So it's been here a long, long time. All right. Look. Did you hear it? Did you hear it? I probably can't hear it, but I'm moving. Probably a bird or something, but anyway. God, this is so cool. Plus, I get to do editing. I can't seem to locate the cave. Did it again? So I guess I'm going to come back. Because the sun is starting to go down. All right, let's head up. Okay, I'm huffing and puffing a little bit on the way back, but I noticed this. I think it's supposed to say, uh, I can't even see where this thing's recording. Uh, this is stolen land. I'm already, I think I'm lost. No, I'm not lost. It was down this way. Okay. But I'm really glad I came out today. You know, it's just a little thing like this. Okay. You know what the amazing thing is? Hang on. Wait a minute, I did not come this way. Brian's lost. It was bound to happen, so back out we go. Anyway, the amazing thing is, is as kids, we never ever got poison oak or poison ivy. See, I've lived in Simeo most of my life. And uh, we first moved here, early 70s. Whew, Simeo was a lot of orange groves. Walnut trees. I think there was one McDonald's, believe it. One pizza place. Uh, the movie theater was down in Larwin Square, if any of you remember that one. And when Man Six over, it was a big deal. Coming to the adventure of the sporadic cell phone. So where are cell phone sporadic explore? And uh, hike. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, subscribe to my channel. Please tell your friends. Stay creepy, and I'll be back soon. Thank you for watching.
so proud.